So I start by explaining the information processing model of memory. It's very simple, and it's, uh, the diagram is on your handout. Basically, all the information from your world comes to your brain through your senses. Everything you see, hear, smell, taste, and touch, correct, is right now hitting your brain. You're thinking, oh, this is a comfy chair, um, oh, maybe you smell food cooking, whatever. All these are pieces of information constantly going to your brain. However, at this stage of processing, your memory is very brief. The information comes in and it fades, and it does this continually, and you're not even aware of it. For example, when I look at this half of the room and see all your faces, by the time I've turned my head to look here, that image has faded. It's already gone. All right, so sensory memory is about one to three seconds. We don't even know it's happening, but it helps us to function in our world. What's interesting to us, then, is short-term memory and long-term. Uh, but before we can explore short-term, I'm going to ask you to participate in a couple of very simple demonstrations.